stars of the film American Pie like to get down with apple pies and dogs? What's up? I'm Jackson Blue. Welcome to Celebrity Dirt, powered by CelebrityWeek.com. Disgusting? Yes. Factual? You bet your schnauzer. Natasha Leone from American Pie has finally turned herself into courts after being accused of sexually molesting a neighbor's dog. She had failed to show up at four separate court hearings, but finally decided to show up this past Friday at a court in New York. She faces a bunch of different charges like criminal mischief, harassment, and trespassing after it's being said that she threatened to sexually molest her former neighbor's dog and then ripped a mirror off the wall just for good measure during an argument back in 2004. The judge in the case said the charges would be dropped if she stayed out of trouble for the next six months. Something tells me if you look through her pantry at her house, you'd find lots of peanut butter and crack. Spider-Man 3 comes out in 2007, and it might be the last one. Kirsten Dunst has been alluding to the fact that it might be the last Spider-Man, and now Tobey Maguire is doing the same thing in interviews. He says, quote, this might be a good place to stop. I am not tied contractually to do any more Spider-Man movies. I would say the odds were in favor of this being the last one. Well, if Tobey backs out and they want to keep on making Spider-Man movies, maybe they can hire this guy. Oh my god, he's naked. And that's the smallest web shooter I've ever seen. The stars are coming out of the woodwork one by one to support Britney Spears. Mary J. Blige came out saying she thinks Britney's just going through a phase, let her do her thing. And now, Mel Gibson is coming out in support of Britney Spears. Oh, there's a tag team the media would have a frenzy with. Gibson says, I feel compassion for someone like Britney. Your heart goes out to her because I'm positive that at her core, she's a good woman. As long as she's not Jewish. I'm just kidding. He didn't say that last part. Although you know he was thinking it. Happy Hanukkah to all our Jewish friends out there, by the way. And finally, a week or two ago, we were talking about Britney Spears and her homework from childhood and how it went up for auction and only took about $200. Well, if Britney Spears' homework went for $200, what do you think something like the cowardly lion suit from the film The Wizard of Oz would go for? Or Elvis Presley's wedding ring? eBay just held a memorabilia auction and both those items were up for grabs. Elvis Presley's wedding ring, the most important ring in his life grabbed $90,000. And the actual cowardly lion suit worn in the film The Wizard of Oz grabbed $700,000. If you're willing to pay $700,000 for a lion costume, you gotta be the richest nerd ever. Okay, fine. Second richest nerd. We're still looking for your votes for the most annoying celebrity of 2006 for our year-end reports. Send your vote to us right now at jacksonblue at kiss108.com. Marsha's vote goes to Paris Hilton. She says, for God's sake, why can't this girl get over herself? When she dances, I just want to throw up. Darn, she's annoying. Darn, I hate her. And Baltimore says, the most annoying celebrity to me, if he falls into the category, would have to be Bush. That's right, George W. Bush. I am so sick of seeing this man on the news media. Ugh. Thank you guys for the emails. Keep them coming. Jackson Blue at Kiss108.com. Okay, that's it for today's Celebrity Dirt, powered by CelebrityWeek.com. Have a great day. Come back tomorrow for a fresh batch of dirt. Otonoeve. Otonoeve.